this is very basic questions but people ask a lot that why there is two theta in xrd petrol when we see xrd graph so here is two theta instead of theta this is how people ask questions uh, that why two theta why the two theta and why is two theta in xrd is xrd why two theta use instead of theta so all these questions are gather and people ask a lot there are basically two types of scan the first one is basically called theta to two theta scan uh, in this arrangement the x-ray tube is basically fixed here and the sample rotate at theta for a minute usually when we want to shine uh, the, the x-ray on the sample so initially this theta is basically equal to 5 degree we just keep the the sample inclined here right and this sample can rotate up to 45 degree i will show in the next image here so the sample in this in this arrangement in this uh, arrangement theta to 2 theta scan the the the, the x-ray tube is constant it is fixed the sample is rotating and detector is also rotating look now the sample is rotating theta per minute why i use minute because we have to expose the material for a long time not second and the detector simultaneously rotate two theta per minute this means that the the detector is basically rotating faster here it is understood so when initially it was uh, five so the, here the, uh, the the detector was at 10 degree we, we can also this theta is basically here 10 degree here you see here and uh, the maximum angle here is up to 90 so this means that when we when we this when we basically bring this sample to 45 degree so this detector will be here somehow here so this is basically the two theta angle from the transmitted here to here this is basically the two theta t angle here because we are interested in 2 theta here uh, because we want to get the maximum uh, reflection or the maximum diffraction so here we also rotate the sample because the, the crystal the crystal the grains are oriented in different directions so here we also rotate the crystal and as well as we also uh, move the detector very fast to absorb the maximum uh, the reflection of light so here in this theta to 2 theta scan the x-ray tube is basically fixed here the sample rotate at theta per minute and the detector is rotating 2 theta per minute you can see here uh, uh, as I explained that now now with the, the the sample rotate to for this this angle is now almost 45 degree and this 2 theta is uh, 2 theta is almost here at uh, 90 degree you see here it is almost 90 degree so this is how we usually see the range from here from 10 to uh, 90 or 80 degree in xr uh, d or extra extra deflection pattern here so this is the basically angle we are interested in here this is the transmitted x-ray here and this is basically the reflected array here so th this angle we are interested in here because uh, we want to get the maximum uh, reflection from the crystal so here we rotate the crystal as well as we rotate the detector.